So here I am on my first ever little road trip sales, pull in some new retailers trip. I just had my first sale. It was a really good one. I think the store is so cool too. And um, I think that they will do well there. I'm just really excited. So come down and purchase it. So they'll want to keep carrying my stuff. Bye. Brookings is where I grew up and this beach behind me is one that in cross country we used to come and run in here and then run uh, like sand races and sand uh, sprints and then our coach would make us stand in the ocean and stand there and it was so cold and oh my god just seeing my home smelling the ocean I did not go to where I used to live which is up the Winchuck River but one of the harder things for me was seeing the um, boat dock where the Carolyn Ruth, my parents' fishing boat that my dad built and they both fished on, um, where it used to be docked. My daughter, Tara, used to go out and she was on the boat with him quite a bit, so it just brought back tons of memories. I am in Gold Beach now. Um, oh my gosh, it's so fun. I drove into town and there is the Curry County Fairgrounds and I was the duck champion with Wiffle Duck. My duck was named Wiffle Duck. That's where um, I am now. Just picked up some paintings from Gold Rush Center and I'm going to, and there's a dog going by, and uh, they still carry my jewelry. But... Hard to stay on task and get to Bandon before the galleries close. So this is the um, bridge to, into uh, Gold Beach. memories of Florence are when my oldest daughter Tara used to come and uh, she would stay on the boat, the Carolyn Roof, with my fisherman parents for about a month each year and there were a couple years where they were fishing out of Florence and so this is the adorable little town where they would stay and I remember coming to visit her, actually I guess I was picking her up but uh, going wandering into some of the art galleries and stuff and just being like oh I want to be an artist like that someday. Oh my god. I am. That gorgeous bridge though, isn't that pretty? It just doesn't get much better than this. This has been the best visit to the coast ever. I guess the trick is stay away for six or seven years and then come back. Although, on the other hand, there wasn't a single moment when I lived here that I didn't appreciate it. Love the ocean. This is Florence, Oregon. Hasita Head Lighthouse. Actually, I'm right by Sea Lion Caves. I don't think you guys can hear the sea lions, but I can. Uh, you know, trying to rush to get to Hots, and how can you just not stop at these beautiful places? I don't know, can you see the lighthouse behind me? It's kind of in the mist. Anyway, on to Yachts. I seem to have a story for every place that I stop, so, <laughs> I mean, what can I say? I grew up on the Order of Coast. So here's my hot stories. First married and I realized I was 17 with a child, married, living in a small town in Oregon, and I was driving up the coast. I drove through Yahats. It's like I came around the bend and there was this little bay and I was like, oh, it's like a deep breath. I was like, I want to be an artist in a little cabin, a little a little house close to the beach in your hots and that's the life I want. Isn't it interesting that, you know, so many years later, I'm 48 now, so that, oh good lord, that would be 31 years, <laughs> 31 years or so later, um, I am an artist living the simple life and um, hopefully figuring it out finally. <laughs> woke up this morning with just a headache and it's from all the cleaners which I'm not sure but I think they used in the motel and by that I mean there were definitely cleaners there I'm just not sure if they knew how to use them 
I just finished breakfast at Cafe Stephanie in Nye Beach uh, in Newport. So this is day, what is this, day three of my first sales rep coastal road trip. And I am off to explore Newport and Nye Beach and hopefully find a new retailer, like one in Nye Beach and one in Newport. That's the goal. Just me and the octopus in Nye Beach. <laughs> find my friends where I can. Okay, where am I at now? I'm still in Newport and now I'm, I got a new retailer at Night Beach and now I am on my way down to the Newport Bay area. I had to stop, of course, the bridge because, well, look at it. I had to stop the bridge, enough said. <laughs> um, I'm going to go visit Ozone Gallery, which I've heard good things about and I know that Cheryl Garcia has her work there so it must be good and then I'm going to go and visit other galleries and stores and look for one place in the Bay Area to uh, carry my my necklaces and possibly my art. Onward! And now I am at Depot Bay love Depot Bay although it's not storming so I don't know if the water is squirting through the rocks but my second favorite thing other you know about actually probably my favorite thing about Depot Bay is the little the little inlet whatever it's called where the boats have to go through to get into the port look at how tiny it is <laughs> they can barely make it through Lincoln City now and I have to say the galleries just amaze me up and down the coast. I will, you know, there's a lot that are, you know, they're cool, they're galleries. And then there's some like this one that you walk in and your mouth, your jaw drops. It's like, oh my god. Good morning, I am in Seaside, Oregon. Going to, I don't know if I've ever been here, so I'm going to explore it a little bit. I know I've driven through Cannon Beach, and I'm, I guess I would have driven through Seaside as well, but then you don't really get to see the downtown if you're just driving through, so um, I'm going to explore a little bit and see if there are any cool little gift shops or gallery. There's some really cool galleries here. You know, it's important to find the one where my work would fit, um, not just my jewelry, of course, but hopefully my art as well. And the, the one that was number one on my list is the one that I still want. She's very interested but needed to contemplate. So I actually think I'm going to just make a list of the other ones I like but not pass out my info and see what happens with, with number one choice. I'm starting to learn to shoot for what I really want. This is Cannon Beach and it was beautiful. Next town, Portland. So I am in Portland now, and I have to admit, I feel like I'm not getting that much accomplished um, today anyway. I did get one new retailer, yay me, um, in the Alberta Art District. Um, but Head home. I think Grandma and Emmy are missing me. So, see you soon.